What's up you guys, it's Hosh with Techies here, and today I'm going to show you the all new content aware move in Photoshop CS6, so stay tuned. Now basically when you open Photoshop CS6, this will be the whole new layout that it comes up with, that it comes up with. And now you can see it's a lot different from Photoshop CS5 due to, due to like the darker colors and all the different tools that I'll make sure to get to in future videos. <laughs> But for this video, what we're going to focus on is just something called Content or Move, an all new plugin that Photoshop CS6 has that's a lot different from Photoshop CS5. So basically, this is how it's going to happen. Once you drag your photo um, into the Photoshop browser or into the Photoshop uh, menu, whatever you want to call it, you want to you want to make sure that there's a there's a nice um area of uh there's a nice gray area between the object and the place you want to you want your object to be. Because basically this is how the plugin will work, or the the tool the tool will work. Um, you're gonna take one object and you're gonna move it to a different part, um, and move it to a different spot in the frame of the photo. So let's say I wanted to move this ship right here to somewhere over here. Then um, before in Photoshop CS6, what I would have to do is just drag it over there. Then um, um, content delete the remains, and you can see a video of me doing that down here. But for this video, it's going to be a lot easier since you're using the all-new tool content or move. So what you're going to want to do is um, open your image, and I'll show you. I'll give you a link to the image down um, down in the description box so you can try it out for yourself. And make sure to leave video responses because um, I want to see what you guys do with the with the new tool in Photoshop CS6. And you could also download a trial of Photoshop CS6 down here as well. So what you want to do is um, click J on your keyboard, and what that'll do is bring up content or move. Or you can just go to this tool right here and then just open content or move. And so basically before you do anything, what you're going to want to check before you use the tool is the adaptation. And what the adaptation means is um, how many pixels um, or how much gray area do you want when moving your object. So if you want um, no gray area at all, at all, if you want it to be like really strict, then you're obviously going to want to click very strict. But if you want it to be more of a, more of a, like a generic uh, selection, then what you're going to want to do is click very loose. I'm just going to go in the middle and click medium. So uh, once you do that, that's pretty much all you're going to have to worry about for mode. Um, you could just, just just leave it to move. If you wanted to extend, obviously you'd be extending the image, but I don't, we don't want to do that. We want to move it to a different part in the frame. And I'm going to just quickly go around, go around this object right here because I'm going to want to move it somewhere else. And so now that you've done that, you can basically click that object and now drag it down like that, as easy as that. And now Photoshop has done the rest of the work for you. And now you can see that it still has some stuff, whoops. Now you can see it still has some areas right there, but that's that's a quick fix. All you have to do is go around those areas, press shift delete to use content aware, then press OK. And now you can see it looks like we we moved the boat down more on the picture and even if you see some little distortions right here that um, no other person would catch but we know it's there because we use the tool um, you could also you could also use things such as the patch tool to just get rid of those lines if you want to if it really bugs you then you could always you know you just use a patch tool and so now you can see that it looks like the boat was supposed to be there. It looks like um, we didn't really change anything about the picture, but, you know, we did. So that will just be our secret. And, you know, thank you guys so much for watching. And make sure to subscribe. I'm up here. I don't know. They always change it. But thank you guys so much for watching. And make sure to check out my other videos. And peace.